Hi everyone, I'm Tally, this is Farrell and we are Board of It and welcome to our review of the Wingspan Fan Art Pack. So this is a little expansion accessory to Wingspan where I guess Stomai did a contest of fan art submissions for the bird cards in Wingspan and his various expansions and they accepted about, I think, 255 <laughs> uh, across a variety of cards and different styles, art styles. So essentially what this is, is, yeah, so it's, it's bird cards with different art. And the good thing and part I really like about this expansion is that the cards come across basically all the expansions. So the European expansion, the Asian expansion, the Oceanian expansion. So what this means is that it's a really nice little pack, both for its kind of artistic value mm -hmm. and the novelty it brings to the game but also because you can then easily get a load of bird cards without buying those other expansions yeah. so what, what did you think of uh, fan art expansion i really really enjoyed it uh, i think it's really fun like you say that the cards are in different art styles mm. so just even every time you get one of the cards just to have a look see who created it uh, it's different age ranges as well, so some have been drawn by kids and they're pretty like cute and funny. Those are my favourites by far, yeah. it's just so funny. <laughs> and then some by adults of course, and it just really makes me want to continue playing Wingspan. It's a game that we really enjoy, but it's not something that we get out all the time now. Probably we'd mostly get it out if people come over and then yeah. request it. We maybe wouldn't play it by ourselves so mm -hmm. much. But the addition of this, and just like you say, the novelty of it, makes me really want to actually get it out when it's just us two now, so that you can start literally just having a look at the cards because they are so yeah. fun. Um, so yeah, I, I really like it for that reason. It kind of reinvigorated my uh, desire to play Wingspan, I think. It's also arguably makes it more interactive because you just like see these birds and you're like, look at this <laughs> yeah. all the time. Uh, some because they're funny and others because they're like quite brilliant and it's also cool with the different art styles so you have a mix like we said we touched upon the kind of children's like hand-drawn art style then you also have some like really weird ones like woodcuts or mosaic mm. style and those are really cool um, and it just I, I've, I have to say I've never and this isn't actually a knock on the art obviously in the original Wingspan because that's a huge part of what made it popular yeah but yeah it's just I think it's because it's also the focal point of these cards. It's like, I've never been so interested in the art, do you know what I mean, as I am yeah. when I throw this in. It's because there's so, such a wide variety, like you say, obviously the art in the Wingspan like base game is super beautiful and I love it. And exactly like you say, part of the reason why I love it is it does look so beautiful, but it is the same style. So just with this pack, it, it just makes you super interested to pull each card because it could be completely different style from the last one. And they have the little blurb at the bottom about kind of who, who mm. designed it and what media it's been designed in. So, yeah, just super nice, super interesting and gives a little spark back to Wingspan for me. Yeah, so I think um, uh, also it might be one of my favourite expansions probably after the European expansion for Wingspan just because even though it's more of an accessory, because the cards are the same cards that are in all the other games and expansions, so it's not like there's new mechanisms mm. or they're shifted, just different art. But if you just say have Wingspan, then this is such a terrific way to just expand core Wingspan without having to dive into the expansions, yeah. because you get so many cards from across so many different expansions. And I do think that maybe they're not all like perfectly compatible because I think you said you saw some with Nectar on yes. which comes from the Oceana expansion but that, I, I never saw any that mm. you know I couldn't use yeah so I think a lot of people will tend you know if you don't want to go too hard into the expansions you might get wingspan and then maybe the European expansion because it's most basic add some cards add some goals but this is like perfect for just if you're happy with your base wingspan maybe you play with your family and you just want to expand the birds basically because some yeah. people they do just want an expansion with a bunch more birds to add variety mm -hmm. so that's kind of cool you know that you get that element from this but i mean yeah is uh, being that it's just kind of cards there's not i think too much more to say mm -hmm. but we're obviously pretty enamored with it i didn't expect to be 
this into it or like yeah. it so much. But I think it just hits, like we say, both those points of it's fun to look at and then talk about it and share. And it's also quite a neat little expansion. I mean, we have all the expansions, so in that aspect, not so neat to us. But yeah. I do like it for that for other people. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Anything, any final words you want to say? Get it. Get it. Oh, and very importantly, actually, you probably should have said this at the start. This uh, expansion we provided as a review copy by Stonemaier Games. And we really appreciate you watching. Uh, we hope it was helpful. Please ask us any questions about this or anything else, Wingspan. Mm -hmm. Please subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps us. And thanks for your time, and we'll see you next time. Bye.